Some say the early 2000s was the golden era of Jiu Jitsu. If that were true, then 2004 will definitely be the pinnacle of those times, a year when more superstars emerged than ever before. Two such names were Ronaldo Jacare and Fabrizio Verdun. In one of the most memorable and exciting matches of all time, they faced off in the semi-finals of the 2004 CBJJO World Cup Open. Jacare, with his superior takedown and passing skills, was constantly on the attack despite being outweighed by a significant amount. Verdun, playing cautiously, was strategic with his energy and only used calculated attacks. Jacare took Verdun down at will and when that wasn't enough, he executed one of the wildest sweeps ever caught on film. It looked like a setup for a flying triangle. Jacare leapt into the air from the two-on-one arm control, supported mid-air by Verdun. Jacare switched up his control by posting on one hand, slid under Verdun, and used his shin to propel him into the air. Jacare used that momentum to come on top and score two points. The venue went crazy, and later on when the internet came around, the clip of this incredible technique would go viral. Following that exchange, Verdun was able to escape and reverse Jacare, but the two would end up standing once again, Jacare's domain. Verdun attempted to change his strategy and up the pace of the match, but Jacare's defense was at an all-time high. He countered every attack and went on to win by points. Both would go on to compete at the World Championships a week later, the event where Jacare had his famous match with Hodger Gracie and Verdun faced off with Fernando Tedere. 2004 was the last time we saw Verdun compete in the Gi. Both of them switched to MMA and became two of the biggest crossover names in the sport, representing Jiu Jitsu at the highest levels.